What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, welcome to another bonus reading. So what I want you to do is just choose in your mind, number one, two or three, whatever number comes up first. So either one, two or three, and um, you know, whatever resonates with you, uh, or you can look at the whole reading if you want to. I'm going to draw from this beautiful deck of cards, which was a gift from me to up to me from my sister. <laughs> All right, so, um, and I'm just really going to draw one card for each and then see what messages I intuit intuitively get with that, okay? For any of you that are maybe having some hardship at the moment, life's a little bit difficult, you know, um, I want you to, to, to just hang in there and keep the faith, okay? It's a chilly, chilly day in Cape Town. Beautiful day. Got a pot of soup going, obviously. <laughs> um, and I've just had some time in between some personal readings. And um, I'm going live on Facebook a little bit later today. And um, yeah, need to set up for my spiritual regression hypnosis session tomorrow. But I just want to pop in quickly, you know, with a, with a reading for you. As you know, I do. Um, if it's your first time here, welcome. My name is Adrian. I'm a psychic medium holistic wellness practitioner. Or if you, you know, just popping in, welcome back. I've got a weekly reading for all the zodiac signs as you know or may know and you could resonate you're more than welcome to subscribe so card number one and there'll be timestamps in the flow everything is smooth sailing all right so you know if it's if it's feeling a bit tough at the moment if it's feeling a bit difficult at the moment if it's feeling a bit pressurized at the moment if you're feeling like, oh my goodness, you know, what next? Where do I go from here? Sometimes we forget that there is this incredible source that we are an extension of, you know, and this source that we are an extension of. We are, a, a, we are a, a natural extension of love. And we forget sometimes that this source wants us to succeed, wants us to be happy, wants us to do well, you know. And um, so, and when you kind of adapt this mindset, it changes everything for you. So if you may be struggling a little and you know, you, you know you get those days where it feels like the entire universe is against you, you know? If you are, just a reminder that you are an extension of flow and that this beautiful energy is always by your side. It's always there to support you. It's always there for you every step of the way, you know? And even though it might not seem so right now, the source, this intelligence sees the big picture. It knows what's going to happen a year, two, three, four, five years from now. And so sometimes when things are not going 100% the way that you'd like them to go, maybe just remind yourself that, um, you know, maybe this is part of a bigger plan that I'm just not aware of yet. Number two, valiant courage. Take action with passion. All right, so you know, if you're faced with anything that you maybe want to do, any next level, anything like that, um, sometimes we feel very on the fence about things. You know, we're like, Do I do this? Don't I do this? Will it work out? Won't it work out? What is sort of the plan here? But what I think what we forget in those moments sometimes is that. The universe is always on our side. You know, I always say this, that a lot of times we feel that life is really on my side right now. Everything is going so well, you know, God and the angels and everything is just on my side. You know, kudos, 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 kudos to the max all over the place. But I think what we don't realize sometimes is that life is always on our side. Source is always on our side. If you happen to watch the number one part of this reading, you would see that I was speaking there about this amazing source that we are from that wants us to win, okay? But it's up to us to open ourselves to that and to let that love flow, to let that abundance flow, to let those opportunities come to pass, okay? So what is your passion? What, what ignites your soul? What makes your heart beat boom, boom faster, you know? What makes you feel happy? Go with that, lead with that. Let life show you beauty okay number three answering the call 
the time is now all right the gates to prosperity is always open to us the gates of abundance the gates to an entire new and different way of being is always open to us it's always available to us okay and um, if you feel that you are sort of like inclined towards doing something and sometimes we sit around and we wait for a sign what if you're waiting for a sign take this as a sign okay out of all the millions or billions of things you could have been seeing on YouTube right now this is what you're getting to see so take this as the sign take this as the sign that you've been looking for and may it serve you in abundantly positive ways to just go forward that the thing about divine timing I think that we sometimes misunderstand is that divine timing is when you decide for it to be when you understand that you've got so much more say in this world over how things go very different story okay so this is just me with a very very quick check-in um, and as often as I can I'd like to do this um, if you want to have a look at your reading for the past week um, actually this week's readings might have been quite exciting I was speaking about what's holding you back and next week I'm talking about your superpowers in next week's videos so if it resonates with your heart you're more than welcome to subscribe um, and if you want to you can follow me on Facebook and Instagram and if you're interested in spiritual regression hypnosis my link for my profile to do that online is available down below as well